can call me Norman Rad. Most of these new rappers suck, but some of them they aren't bad. Bad child like Kid Cudi, he is hella cool. I like J Electronica, Blue and Yellow Wolf. Evidence is high. Hey guys, Canadian Shushi here from uh, the hookahcartel.com. Um, coming to you with an unboxing from 5starhookah.com. This is probably the biggest order I've ever put in. And uh, I'm really excited to show you guys what I got. Now, just so you know, um, there is a ton of uh, wrapping over here. Um, I didn't want to sit down for 20 minutes and make a video. Um, I wanted to show you guys what I got and uh, explain to you guys kind of you know how good the service was so I opened everything and set it up on top um, I haven't looked at my um, my stems or anything yet I'll show you that stuff first but let me get into some of the goodies I got and uh, we'll go from there alright <clears throat> so uh, this is a pretty big box as you can see um, first off uh, Alex from 5 Star Hookah had a contest where um, you posted a picture of you smoking in a creative place and the winner got both of the new flavors of Naklamizo, so I won, and I got Naklamizo Blueberry and uh, Naklamizo Lychee. Um, so I thank you for putting that contest on. That was an awesome contest, and I had a lot of fun with it. Um, let's get into... I got a bunch of bowls in here. I got an, uh, uh male, uh, unglazed, um, regular bowl. Um, I get... You know, for a lot of people who've seen these unboxings, you can probably already guess what I got. Um, I got a male, unglazed, uh, Turkish funnel. Um, and that's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be, actually. So that's pretty nice. Um, also, I got the adapter, the male to uh, female adapter as well for that. And a uh, kind of a cool-looking um, Egyptian um, bowl as well. Um, my other Egyptian bowls kind of look... You know, just regular, and this one's got kind of a nice design to it, so um, it's nice as well. Um, I was also thrown in the Shawshank, the little homemade uh, hand poker. Um, so I really like that. I, uh, I appreciate that, man. That's a good, uh, a good throw in for sure. Um, as well as I got my little um, bag full of uh, freebies for the hookahs stuff. So I got uh, two Alpha Kier um, Kiwi. Two Alpha Gear, uh, Double Apple, two Holland Coals, and uh, I purchased six um, hose uh, grommets and a uh, hose plug in there as well. So um, that's what I got in there. Uh, so that was pretty good stuff. And uh, they also threw me in a um, 100 gram Tangiers Old School Watermelon. Um, I'm loving the melon blend right now, so I'm really excited to try that. Um, yeah, and uh, I purchased, this is cool too, I love this, I purchased the uh, Hookah Cartel t-shirt um, from the site, and uh, Alex actually threw me in a five-star Hookah t-shirt as a gift there, so appreciate that, man, I'll definitely make sure I rock that in my videos. Um, I've got a extra-large gold wind cover here, um, I picked that up, I thought it would look really good on the Hookah I purchased. Uh, so I picked that up, um, and uh, this is the gold tray that's going to be going with my uh, my hookah. So that uh, I don't have a tray like that yet, um, but I really like how the middle spire kind of fits up, and it will fit really good with the the port. So um, that's great. Also, the Elmas uh, wind cover and brass tongs. So now you guys probably know exactly what I'm getting. Um, so that came in great condition. It's nice. It's uh, it's pretty solid. Um, I'll also go into like a closer look, guys. I'm gonna do a review on both of these hookahs, so I'll go into a closer look on everything. But uh, here's that beautiful uh, plate-sized uh, Elmas tray. Uh, that thing is detailed and gorgeous. A um, little bit of a scratch on the bottom there, but you know what? It's uh, it's okay. Um, the top of it looks great, um, so I'm not too worried about it. And uh, here is my beautiful blue Elmas base. Uh, it's really cool. I mean, this part here looks solid like it's not going to move. It's a heavy, heavy glass. Um, barely any imperfections in it. It's actually very, very well made and super, super thick. Um, that is a beautiful base. And uh, also, I got the my favorite jumbo base that I saw, the light blue and gold. Um, jumbo base. Uh, I thought that this was just such a nice looking base. 
Uh, there's a few imperfections, but again, hand-blown Egyptian glass, that's going to happen. All in all, I'm very, very happy with the state of this. It came in really good condition, so I'm not too worried about it. And as you guys can see, just a crap ton of packing peanuts. Um, always dig around when you order from Five Star, though. You never know if they throw you something, you know, a little something in there for you. So you always want to just keep your eye open. Um, now, this box is probably taller than I am. Um, it is absolutely freaking long. So uh, let me get into this box for you guys. Um, a little cleaning brush set that... Uh, also was thrown in. I don't know if it comes with the hookah package or if uh, they gifted this to me, but I really appreciate these. Um, it's a good size and uh, that's going to fit the Elma space really perfectly. So I appreciate that. That's awesome. Um, let me get into the hoses here. Um, this is awesome. I'm excited for this. Um, it was great. Uh, Mary actually gave me a call just to make sure that she was sending out uh, the right um, hose for me because I, uh, I wanted a specific one and uh, I got the uh, the one I wanted so this is the Elmas giant ass baseball bat I don't know how well you can see that but it's got this really cool uh, I think it's a wooden uh, no it's, a, it's like an acrylic tip um, with wood inside a beautifully handcrafted wooden top um, this is like a uh, upholstery like a curtain or something you can see the stitch line which is cool um, this is some sort of raised fabric, and it goes into, um, I, think it, they, I think they said goat skin um, uh, hose. People keep talking about how it smells, but I don't, I don't smell anything, so that's good. And uh, as you can see, it matches the bottom with the tape, because uh, on the Elmas hoses, you use the tape as the grommets. Beautiful, beautiful hose, and uh, airtight, awesome. Um, so I, I'm excited to use that. I've been excited the whole time. Now some of you guys out there might uh, get upset on this uh, this hose that I picked up, but uh, I got it so I can do a fair um, comparison with the other washable hoses that I got. Instead of ordering an Ajun, which I which I really was gonna do, I did order a Narbiche. Um, I really just wanted to be able to compare uh, the hoses kind of in a fair way. Um, I keep hearing good things about it, so you know what, if, if it's a good product, I want to be able to give it a good review, regardless of the maker. Um, but uh, So that's the hose that came with the other hookah there, um, was the uh, Narbiche. Now let's uh, get into some of the good stuff. I've got a, I bought a couple clear um, base protectors as well, and I just saw this strapped to the side of a pair of hookah tongs. Um, now let me double check everything here. Uh, make sure there's nothing, oh, uh, oh, nice, uh, box of Coco Jammers, big dent at the top, but that's probably just from, uh, shipping, so that's okay, um, it's such a big order, I can't always remember what I got, so I don't know if there's anything else in there, anyways, let's start with the beautiful KM Balia, man, I've been excited for this pipe forever, and I'm really surprised because this doesn't look like any other Berea I've ever I've ever seen. Um, in the middle, as you can see, it's a dual tone, right? Um, and in the middle, it's actually got little copper um, pharaohs um, on the bottom. Usually, I've seen these spires go all the way down, and this whole part's gold. But uh, on this one, for some reason, I've got uh, dual tone uh, with the pharaohs, and it's more of a sleek kind of inline look to the hookah itself. Um, it still has the amazing brass hearts, um, the beautiful uh, middle piece, but it's just a little cleaned up. Um, it's got some pretty pretty messy weld spots, so I'm going to have to just kind of take care of that. Um, and this one spire is, uh, it's got a little bit of a space in between it, but I'm not too worried about it. The only thing is, is this one, this spire here is loose, um, so I'm going to have to look into that, but I'm not too worried about it. And uh, this hose port is huge, um, absolutely gorgeous. Uh, I think everything's good with it. Uh, but yeah, that is my KM Barria. Um, I've been waiting forever to have one of these. This is the first pipe I've ever wanted. Um, so I'm really excited about that. And uh, let's take a look here at the beautifully detailed um, Elmas 628. Um, let me grab my scissors here. 
Now, I've, uh, I've, I was intrigued by these, definitely. Um, I thought they just looked super beautiful and authentic, so I really wanted to purchase one uh, just to take a look at it um, and uh, smoke something a little bit more traditional. Uh, so, uh, wrapped really well, that's good. All right, here we go. So, as you can see, holy, A, this thing is freaking heavy. And it's not even that big. Like, it is solid, solid, solid brass. Um, it does have an open chamber, but it doesn't have a purge valve, so that doesn't actually matter. Um, so that's okay. Uh, super, super detailed. And I love this. Even on the back of the, the tray there, it's fully detailed. Um, absolutely gorgeous. And, uh, yeah, the you know, they always say, like, there's where the casting was, they sand down the side there. Barely noticeable, guys. You can't even tell. Um, it's a copper down stem with a little brass fitting on the end there uh, to make a bell shape. And uh, very heavy, very gorgeous. And uh, this very well might be the first hookah that I go smoke out of. So um, that was my entire order, guys. Um, everything came. Uh, nothing was damaged. Um, and, you know, always a 5 out of 5. I got some great gifts, uh, so I really want to thank you for that. Um, thanks again, Alex, for throwing on the uh, photo contest so I could try out those two new flavors. And, uh, yeah, guys, uh, definitely check out the hookahcartel.com. Check out 5starhookah.com and go to my YouTube channel, comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll keep hitting you guys up with reviews. Um, as you can see, I'm going to do a review on my Elmas, on my Berea, on, uh, on my two flavors here. Um, so we got a lot of different uh, reviews coming up. Anyways, Canadian Shisha. I'll catch you guys later. About our enemies, rapping like this ten me. Call like a tarantula, creep like a centipede. Mad child from SM, they'll remember me. I'm a renegade, stone drinking lemonade. I'm a heavyweight.